Yes. What is this? This, my friends, is a functioning and brand new Targa top. Look at that bad boy. That was awful. So I gotta decide if I'm gonna paint this or not. I might just wrap it. I think honestly that's what I'm gonna do. I'll wrap it. And then I'll put the uh, edging on it at the end. Here's this around. Yes sir. There she is, my friends. We are back in business with a new Target Top. All right, guys, so as you guys can see, the new top is here. I do have the framing here, but it did not come, unfortunately, as it was advertised. On the website, it was advertised via, or it was advertised basically stating that the weather stripping and the framing for the weather stripping here was already installed but unfortunately it was not so actually i have the other the other framing right here we got the old top you can see it's in pretty rough shape but anyway so here's the other side so the framing looks like it's pretty you know it's pretty well made it's pretty sturdy pretty durable um and all the screws came with it and everything and you can see the mounting holes look you know they all look correct so the main issue is just you know, obviously you want to make sure you got what you paid for. You want to make sure that what was advertised is, and what, what you purchased are the same. So I do have a call in to Zip Corvettes. They, they were very friendly and helpful. Um, so they're going to get back to me later on today, I'm assuming. So this is going to be a pretty short video. Um, but I did want to kind of just show you guys the target top. I added some, some felt, uh, kind of some felt material here. Um, just for kind of sound deadening purposes. Um, I, I had it on my old top as well. Like right on the front here, you can see it. Same stuff, so. And it worked great, so. And I actually, it actually came like that. I didn't install it, but. Um, but obviously, yeah, here you can see the. Do that like this. So you can see the old weather stripping and I did actually try to on the other side I tried to peel it off over here just to see what it would look like and see if I could even peel it off and um, obviously that just did more damage than anything else so and it's never a good idea to really use reuse old weather stripping anyway you should really be buying brand new weather stripping when you're going to replace it anyway so that's gonna be pretty much it for this video so hey guys, just a quick um, thank you before we get out and be done with this first video. Um, I just wanna thank you guys. This channel just crossed over 100 subscribers I noticed the other day. I'm so, so thankful. I'm so grateful for every single one of you guys. You guys aren't just button clicks. You guys are real people. You guys are choosing to subscribe. You guys are choosing to like and comment and participate in the community. Uh, and I appreciate that so much from the bottom of my heart, you know. I don't care if 
this channel is one subscriber or a million subscribers. Like I'm eternally grateful for each and every one of you. Obviously, with the monetization rules, this really isn't about the money. This is really about just being a part of a community of people who will share a common interest and how can we help each other and, and support each other. So I, I thank you guys and, and letting me be a part of that and inviting me into your in, into your uh, personal life and, and allowing me to to be a part of your, your personal car enthusiast experience. I wanna get on my soapbox really, really quickly. Um, I was thinking about this the other day, me and a good friend of mine were talking about this. And basically, you know, I want to do something to give back. Um, I, I currently serve at my local church, but there's other ways that we can give back. I would love to hear you guys' feedback on that, but just I want to take a minute and kind of paint a picture for you guys. If you are making less than making more than forty thousand dollars a year, you're in the top two percent of wealthy people in the entire world. Forget about America for a second. If we think globally, you are really in the top two percent of of wealth globally. You know, we, think, we talk about a lot about the 1% here in America, but if you think about it globally, we're almost in the 1% if we make over $40,000. And also in that same, along that same path, if you own one car, you're in the top six to 9% of wealth globally. Um, most of the world lives on less than $3 a day. And so when you think about your, you know, our passion for cars, whether you have a Corvette, whatever kind of car you have, a supercar, just a, you know, just a pile of junk that barely runs. The fact that you have a vehicle is significant in the grand, in the grand picture. And so I don't care the size of this channel, if it's a one subscriber or a million subscribers, like I said before, like who you are is who you are and who I am is the type of person who I really want to give back. Um, and so part of this channel, we're going to do a lot of cool car things, but giving back is going to be a theme as well that coincides. And I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna merge both of those things, but I really wanna do that um, and, and, and help people. I have some ideas, but I'd love to hear you guys' feedback. So off my soapbox now, thank you guys so much for, for subscribing and being a part of the channel. Uh, we got a bunch of cool stuff. I know I keep saying that, but there's a bunch of snow outside still. So I'm limited in what things I can do. And also I got a couple of things that I need to kind of save up some money for. You will see what I'm talking about very, very shortly. But I thank you guys for your patience. Once we get this thing figured out um, with the target top, with the weather stripping and everything, uh, I'll have part two of the, the target top success story. And we'll go from there. Thanks again. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks. Have a blessed day.